Hey, what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today i want to show you how you can do a write on text animation and it's pretty simple you don't have to trace your letters or keyframe it or mask it or anything like that uh, we'll use this amazing website called calligrapher.ai just visit this link now before we do anything else uh, this is not how the website will look like i'm using this extension called dark reader and uh, if i turn this off this is how the website is looks like with the white, white background the reason I'm using Dark Reader is because it just makes my life easier when keying out the text from this background. We're going to record this animation and we're going to key out this animation using any program of your choice. You can use Premiere Pro, After Effects, DaVinci Resolve. I'll be using HitFilm and for HitFilm, I find it easier to key out the white text from the black background. So that's why I'm using Dark Reader. I'm going to turn that on. And once you visit this website you can you have the option to set the speed if you want it fast set it to maximum if you want it slow you can set it to the lowest value i set the legibility to the maximum and stroke width to the maximum as well and then there are nine different text styles that you can choose i like the second one so i can select the second one and enter text here you can just type in your text and now you type your text before hitting the right button over here you have to record the screen um, or this area and once you start recording and then you can just hit the right button you can click on that and you can see that it's writing your text if you don't like how the text looks you can click on write once again and it will just change the uh, handwriting for you you can do do this as many times as you want and if you don't like this font you can change the style to something else and it will change your text select anything that you want and once you are satisfied with the result you can just stop the recording and then you can open up your favorite editing program i'm using hit film express and go to import and just search for that file for that screen recording that you took and click on open to import it and we'd create a composite shot out of it so i'm just going to this composite shot icon and i'm just going to find the spot where i click the right button before the animation happens so it's just right over here and make sure while you record your mouse cursor is to the edge of your screen and not in the middle otherwise it's going to mess up your animation all right so we are there and just to show you that this works perfectly fine i'm going to drag in a video as a background let's use this one okay so let me just drag it below right so you can see uh, we have our screen recording on the top and uh, the video at the bottom so on the screen recording i'm going to mask it out the top and the bottom of it first so select that layer and then double click on the rectangle mask and then with the selection tool which is right over here you can just select that and just drag it down so that you mask out the unwanted parts like so and once you do that then you just have to go to effects uh, and under keying you will find uh, luminance key so we're going to drag this and put it on our screen recording layer and right off the bat you can see that it just removes the black uh, background from your text that's just about it if you want you can just zoom in and you can just like play with the threshold and the tolerance to you know play around with this uh, key if it's not working for you you can play with these values but for me it just works fine and i can just play this animation it just looks cool and that's just about it guys that's how you can create this right on text effect you don't have to like manually trace every letter or keyframe every mask or shape uh, we can just use this amazing website and just record it and just you know key out the background and uh, it's easy as that uh, so yeah thank you so much for watching this video i hope this video was helpful if it was then make sure you like the video and also subscribe to the channel thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one